today I'm very happy to be with you in this lesson of housekeeping operation. As you know, housekeeping is a very wide department in a hotel. Not even being wide, it's also the very important department in a hotel. Because as you know, housekeeping department is the heart of the hotel. With the cleanliness that it offers to the hotel, with the deco, even with the entire ambience of cleanliness that the housekeeping staff have to offer to the hotel. So before we go deep in cleaning, we have first to describe all different users that we have to use, like tools, material, equipment, and product, before we step to the use of those equipments during the cleaning process. So as you know, everyone be aware of what we are going to do. Remember to take notes. Maybe it's, uh, it can't be necessary for someone else, but for you, keep in touch of everything. So before we go ahead, it's better you remember even the outline so you can assess yourself after the, the lesson. The outcome of this lesson, you have to identify all cleaning tools, material, and equipment. You have to differentiate them according to their usage. You have to describe all cleaning materials you have to describe all cleaning equipment. They might be manual equipment or mechanical equipment. So you are most welcome while you are, we are describing the tools. Starting on, my, on all tools that are on this table, we can start maybe with a brush. As you know, we may have different type of brushes. This is a soft brush, which we can use on different soft surfaces. This is a hard brush, of course, with a stick, which can help maybe to, to scribe on the floor. When, where it's a big space, you can't just lay down. You can use this brush. We have also the sponges. Sponges is very important in cleaning, especially when you are cleaning maybe in a soft place. You have to use sponges. These are plastic small bins, which used in a pedal bin or in a dust bin. We can put it in this. This is what we call pedal bin. Pedal bin is mostly used in a toilets. So when you want to put it, remember don't touch with your hands. Remember always to wear gloves. Gloves is among the, plug, uh, the equipment that protects yourself. So before doing anything in cleaning, remember to wear gloves. So I'm going to show you how to use this plastic bag. It can be put in this dustbin or this one. So the closed one, we call it pedal bin because we have to use the pedal when you need to open it. And you can't put the whole bag in the, in the dustbin, but you have to cut it around here. And for cutting it, you have to use the scissor. Scissor also is a tool which is very important in housekeeping. We have to cut it from here. You open it like this. You put it in a dustbin like this. And you set it in the appropriate place. The same way you put in that open dustbin, you have also to put another one in a pedal bin. and you set it apart. Then we can continue with our tools. This is a scoring pad. Scoring pad, it's very helpful for the heavy dust. When you need to remove a heavy dust from the surface, you can use also the 
scoring pads, it's among the scribing. This is cleaning clothes. Cleaning clothes are different, have to be in different colors for different purpose. Because when you are cleaning the table, you have to differentiate the cleaning clothes you are using on, this, on a table for the one you are using on the wall or for the one you are using in the toilet or for the one you are using for glasses. The red one, you use it mostly when you are cleaning the toilet. The blue one, you have to use it when you are cleaning windows. The green one, it's for multipurpose. And the yellow one is for furniture. So I can open it and show it to you. This is how it looks. You have to use it when you are cleaning. Here we have mop. Mop is used when you are mopping in a drying surface and you have to use with a, with a tweezer when you need to dry the place, you use the tweezer. But the, the mop can be in other different type where you can also use this one but remember this one, it can't be used alone. For using this, we will need another cleaning equipment that I will show you. This is a feather duster. Feather duster, it's helpful in dusting, especially because it's long, it's helping in dusting the high surface just for removing dust. This is very helpful in housekeeping also. This is what we call cobweb brush. Cobweb brush is also used in cleaning to remove cobwebs. They mostly stick in a corner, so you have to remove it when you, to use it when you are removing cobwebs. We have also a caddy box. Caddy box is very important tools which help room attendants, public area attendants to carry different chemicals in bottles. You put it inside even with cleaning cloth. Here we also have spray bottles. Spray bottles is also very important in housekeeping because most of the time you can have chemicals in a big jerry can what, where we can, you can't carry that for moving around. So you can put the small quantity in this spray bottle, then you use it while you are cleaning. We have also, this one can be known like a serviette or maybe as a napkin but it help in housekeeping while drying the drying uh, drinking glasses because in the rooms we can have glasses so after washing them you can use this but i want to remember you this one there are some hotels where housekeepers are not the one to clean glasses where they have to take those glasses to f and b they clean for them and bring back when they are clean but in some hotels the room attendants have to clean themselves the glasses. So when you are cleaning the glasses, remember to have this. It helps to dry glasses. I can't forget this one. The caution sign is very important. When you are cleaning the area, this remember to protect people. As you wear gloves, as a personal protective gloves, it protects yourself. So this one, it protects people from outside who came where you are cleaning. So you have to put it in front of where you are cleaning. So everyone who sees it when you are cleaning, he knows that the floor is wet so it can protect him when he's walking around. 
I think we are done with different cleaning tools and material. Be ready for cleaning equipment. <laughs>